it's Sugar Bee Crafts and this is Abby because we're going to do a mother-daughter project for the fall. Ready? It involves boots. Do you love wearing boots? Mm -hmm. Me too, but we want to make them cuter. So, we're going to make cute boot socks. Do you have boot socks? No. Nope. Me either. So let's go make them because DIY is awesome. Mm -hmm. So, we just bought a two-pack of knee-high socks at the store but they're plain on the top. So she can have a pair and I can have a pair. What pair do you like? Straight. Abby's feet are almost the same size as mine. So <laughs> we can share a pair. She's going stripes, I'll go plain. So you need knee high socks. Then you're going to need ribbon to add to the top. And we picked out lacy ribbon. So we've got some cream and white just to have different options. And we've got a white one and a skinny one. Do you have a favorite? Mm -hmm. She likes that one. You're also going to need clothespins to hold the ribbon on while it dries because this is a no-sew project. Do you like sewing? Uh, yeah, I like sewing too. But sometimes no-sew is quick and easy. Mm -hmm. Right? So we're doing no-sew today. So you're going to need fabric glue. fabric glue. This one's called Fabric Fusion. It's from Aline's and then the clothespins will hold it on as it dries. And then we also, we haven't decided yet, but we might put some buttons on just for cuteness. Mm -hmm. All right, let's get started. So the first thing you're going to do is get your socks ready. You're gonna slip a jar inside the top to keep this top of the sock stretched out and ready to apply the ribbon. You're going to cut enough ribbon that it will wrap around the top of your sock twice. Then you'll put glue on the edge and clip it into place until it dries. Then you'll fold pleats into your ribbon working your way around the top. This will create the ruffled edge. Be sure to clip each pleat into place until the fabric fusion has been allowed to dry. We're going to go ahead and repeat that for the top of both of your socks. When you get to the end, you can fold the end under and apply some fabric fusion there as well. Once dry, go ahead and remove those clips your socks are ready. If you would like, you can add some embellishments to your socks. We thought it would be cute to add some buttons. We were unsure where to put the buttons until we tried the socks on. So we did this actually wearing the socks. And then we attached the buttons with Fabric Fusion and we are good to go. 